Hi! Hello! Howdy! Welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network for the Game Boy Advanced. But I'm playing it on my GameCube because I'm a quirky girl like that. Uh, last time we beat Fireman, we saved our mom. What else is there to do? Well, Mega Man says, if you're tired, can we can hit the sack. What, what do you say? Whatever. I, fuck. I can't press L by accident. Uh, so let's go to sleep. I could probably do some other stuff right now, but I don't feel like it. Save the day's events in your PET, sure, let's overwrite, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good night, Lan. Several days after the strange oven explosions... Clip, clop, clip, clop, right. Huh. Who's that handsome devil in front of the school? ACDC Elementary, Den City. This is the place. I don't know what voice I want to give him. Grin. Alright. Man, how come nobody- Okay, okay, that's too quick. What time is it? You got five minutes. What about everyone else? Oh, uh, they're already in school. Duh, what the fuck was that? That was like... Jesus. <laughs> Looks like- Excuse me. <clears throat> Looks like everyone's already in the classroom. Mega Man, any new mail? Lan, didn't you hear what I just said? You better get a class, quick. Oh, that, that was- What? Excuse me? <laughs> that was- Okay, that was probably supposed to be Mega Man saying that. But, actually, no, wait, never mind, never mind. I know what that was. That was- he was repeating what Mega Man said. Never mind. Anyway. Jeez, you have two new messages. The first is net news, student net crime on the rise. The other one's from Miss Yai. I called your name in homeroom for so long, you owe me one. Ah, oh, whatever. That Yai. Ugh. Well, no point in hurrying, I guess. Why do I even bother? Land, check your mail again. It's just the mail from Yai and the, the crime has been up. Student crime. Student net crime, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, 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 yeah there we go. So, since we can, let's stick her. I was gonna say dick around, but I guess not. Land, stop that! Man, it's not- okay, he was just saying that was the teacher's lounge, whatever. Well, uh, homeroom is started. Let's get to class. Alright. This is the nurse's office, I think, right? Well, if this isn't a nurse's office, it's- it's- it's something. Uh, school nurse keeps her records in this PC. Can I jack into it? No. Uh, it, it occurred to me last time that I didn't really explain what jacking in even is. Uh, so whenever I press the R button like this, if there's something nearby that has like a cybernet connection, I can jack into it and send Mega Man in there and we can explore. Uh, so that means kind of like whenever you're in the overworld like this, there's going to be things that you can jack into. And regardless of whether or not you know it, if you just mash R, you'll jack into it automatically. So it's very nice. It's, 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 it's an interesting gameplay mechanic if nothing else. The bed is slightly warm, as, as if someone had been laying here. Well, that's what beds are for, bro. Anyway. Stool? No, no, I can't even interact with the stool. All sad. You check the medicine cabinet. Land guard ship for recover 50G. Cool, I guess. Uh, this is not our classroom. Alright. Well, let's see what's going on here. Prevention first. Perform a virus check once a week. Will do. The supplies are, are, there are cleaning supplies in here, so it's pretty bad. Eh. Power's off, power's off, whatever. Anything? Can I jack into this? No, I can't. Okay. Nothing is being displayed. Alright. So then, the next classroom is ours, I think. You're in fifth grade, right? Hurry up and get upstairs. Oh, okay. I thought, I thought this classroom here was ours. What, what else did you say? Where are the stairs? Right through that door. Very helpful. Thanks. Thanks a million. That's the first graders room. Don't go in there. Why could we go in the other classroom then? That reminds me. <laughs> oh my god. One time when I was at college, uh, I just, I was bored and I was waiting to get picked up because this was before I had my driver's license and I was still living at home. Uh, very short period of my life, rest assured. Uh, I, I was near our, like, it wasn't really like a computer hall area, but it was like, 
It was the building that had a lot of uh, computer labs, I guess, for like, you know, um, math recitations or whatever. And there was a class inside one, but I didn't realize it was a class. I thought it was just an empty student hall or whatever. So I went in there and I and I just got on one of the computers. And then a, there was a teacher there who was helping kids, and I just kind of he never interacted with me, and I just never asked for like a, you know I never needed help and. Just, <laughs> So just, I was in the middle of a class, I just walked in, I used their computer just to browse the internet. It was kinda, kinda it was really funny in retrospect, but, I don't know, I, I guess, the, honestly, the thing about doing shit like that is that if you're confident enough, you can really do whatever you want, uh, to a point at least. Like, there was a time when I was going to the gym where I didn't even know you needed a membership. I thought it was just, like, free. I don't know why. I was, like, a teenager at the time. So I would literally just walk in through the door, and I would just fucking go past, like, the... <laughs> I would just walk past the people in the front, and I would just go to the, the, the bikes and the treadmills and shit, and I would just use them, and they didn't stop me. <laughs> it took me, like... It took me like two weeks before they eventually stopped me, and that was because I went up to them and asked them a question, and they're like, oh, well, do you have your card with you? I'm like, card? Uh, what, what do you mean? Oh, you know, your, your membership card. I don't have one. <laughs> God. <laughs> That's autism for you. Autism makes you do funny shit and you don't even realize it. Extra deaths are here. You found a trip in a... My line reading for this segment has been so bad. I don't care. Hey, what's up? Good morning, this is the library. It's good to read, but shouldn't you be in class? Yeah, what about it? Many small fish are here, very calming. You can look up any book you want with this machine. Can I, can I, can I interact with the machines? This PC manages who borrowed what books. I mean, that's not very futuristic. We already do that. Encyclopedias are lined up on this shelf. Encyclopedias are lined up. Encyclopedias are lined up. Encyclopedias are lined Students who loan the most books are listed here. Yai is number one by far. So that means she reads a lot. What a fucking dweeb. Reference books are lined up on this shelf. Cool. Reference books are cool. I I'm wasting as much time as I can. can have you noticed? Storybooks are lined up on the shelf. Storybook. Oh, okay, cool. Be quiet in the library. Will do. Photo and picture books are on this shelf. Photo and picture books. Photo and picture book. Virus Attack by Rob Fatline. Fatline? From L Books. EI Books, maybe? Or is it L? I was thinking of like L's and like the in Spanish, but whatever. On loan now. Well, well thanks. Something is stuck between the books. Lan found a chip for Escape Age. Cool, I guess. I honestly feel like I should get rid of the Escape Chips in my, uh... In my folder right now. Well, Escape Chip. Just because I shouldn't be using it. But, eh. I don't know. Uh, PET manuals are lined up on the shelf. Cool. Well, I've just sufficiently fuck cunted around enough. Let's, let's move on. That's our classroom. What about this one? Okay, land, homeroom started already, use the back door. Oh, this is our classroom, what about this one? Uh, that room is class B, aren't you in class A? Okay. Well, now we can move on with the plot. Looks like everyone is still in homeroom. Sneak time. Pit pat, pit pat. Pit pat, pit pat. Yeah, I did it. So class, this is Mr. Higsby. He'll be helping me teach class for the next two weeks. Hello, I'm Mr. Higsby. I collect battleships. It's my hobby. I'm looking forward to training ships with all of you. Be sure to come to me if you've got any rare ships, okay? <laughs> Snort. The new teacher's kinda scary. Not really scary, just sort of weird. I didn't think teachers had hobbies too. That reminds me of a line from Ed and Eddie. Our moms, girls. I'm not sure. Well, technically, uh, it beats me. Well, they do say everyone's got to have a hobby. 
whisper, giggle. Everyone, let's give Mr. Higsby a warm welcome, okay? Well, now that's all for homeroom today. Alright. Classroom textbook, blah, blah, blah. That teacher gives me the creeps. Well, maybe I'll trade some ships with them anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can I jack into this yet? No, that's where the next dungeon is anyway, so it doesn't matter. They used to write on the blackboards with this chalk stuff. And then you had to wipe it with a big eraser. Yucky. Now you just jack in it in your PET and you blah blah blah. Jack in it with your PET and have your navy erase blah 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 whatever. That Mr. Higsby sure is strange for a teacher. Is he? L look, I don't want to talk right now. Click, click, click. I'm working on Easter's homework. Click, click. Good to know. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, C, U, V, X, W, Y, Z. I just feel like finishing it for him. Sure is hard remembering these ship codes, but my brother said, remember the order and good will come. What do you have to say, Dex? Man, that weirdo's gonna be our new teacher. That blows. Should we challenge Dex to an F battle? Sure, fuck it. Oh, you better wait till I can upgrade Guts, man, okay? I knew he would do that, that's why I said yes. I was virus busting, something really odd happened. What? Well, I had selected three cannons, see? The three ships all flashed and changed into a rare ship. I was a little scared at first, of course. The ship? Funny, it seemed to return to normal after that. So what you guys talking about is uh, program advance, but they're not really program advances. They're like, they're, okay, so this game has program advances, but they're really simplistic. Uh, what, the idea is that, like she mentioned, you combine three or more of a chip, and if the codes are in a certain order for that chip, uh, like ABC for canon, then you'll get a super special uh, magical power up in that ship. So, like, you'll get a super powerful version of the cannon that'll let you use it for five seconds and give you invis. Anyway. Land, class is about to start. Better not leave now. Where, where's my seat? Hi, I'd like to sit. Where, where am I? Hi. Oh. Okay, I'd like to... Like to I'd like to start. Yes. Oh, I have to talk to her. Okay. Please don't let today be the day that World 3 takes over. Baby girl, bad news for ya. Bad fucking news for ya. Hey, the teacher's coming! Is he now? Well, now. I'd like to begin the first class, huh? I already forgot my, my Higsby voice. I feel bad about it, but I do. I, I did. Whatever. Mr. Higsby, where's Miss Mary? Miss Mary? She was sick and went to the nurse's office. <laughs> what? Quiet, everyone. First class will be study hall. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember my Higsby voice already. Whatever, he'll, he'll be the whatever voice. Alright. Don't rejoice just yet, huh? I want you all to do math drills. I'll be checking them later. Shucks. Now jack into the blackboard, huh? Gotta love that jacking animation. Alright, everyone. Good luck! Man, math is hard, especially in the more... Huh? Eek! What's that? We will now announce the real goal of our plan to control the net. Lan, this is a World 3 re-education program. The World 3's true plan is to start a war. The end game. We will take control of the military net and all other nets. The only cure for this rotten world is deletion. No! Why? Why would they do that? 
To reach our goals, the World 3 is hiring new staff members. We will begin a new instruction program starting today. Children, study well and become good slaves to World 3. What? No way, man, not me. Oh no, I can't turn my terminal off. Hey, the door's locked. Everyone be calm. Me and Gutsman will stop them. Well, well, Dex, where's, where, where are you? Okay, let's talk to everyone, then we'll talk to Dex. We're stuck in here for good, it looks like. I can hear the announcement playing in the next room. Somehow, they took over the entire school network. This, this is a school jacking. Alright. I'm trying to talk. Ah, oh, make it stop! Oh, the humanity! Hi, hi, Mail. This announcement must have played in the other schools, too. That's what's making the crime rate everywhere go up. Wait, really? Deductions by Mail. I looked at the screen and now I feel all funny. I got a really bad feeling about this. Somebody stop this announcement! No, it won't open! Hey, Dex. Lan, I, uh, excuse me. Lan, I know how you feel, really. But you better let me handle this one. Check it out! Me and Gutsman are the bomb! Dex, I don't think you'll be able to do it alone. Let's go, Gutsman! Maybe you should let Lan... Quiet! I'm trying to concentrate! Jack in! I was about to say Mega Man. <laughs> Jack in! Gutsman.exe! Go! Here those viruses come! Yeah! Yeah! Whoa! Hey! What the? Hey! Ah! Uh, yipes! Hell! Blam! Loving, loving this Reader Theater we got going on here. They got him. Dex, do you have a backup? Yeah. That's a relief. Okay, Lan, you're up. Show us your stuff. Lan, please. Let's do it, Lan. Okay, fine, fine. Mega Man, let's go for it. First, let's talk to Roll. Don't be too hard on Mega Man. He's one of your friends, too. If you want, you can bring my Navi Roll with you. I'm sure she can help out Mega Man. Lan got Roll R. So, put it in your chip folder to use roll during a battle. So this is a Navi chip. Navi chips are a hallmark of the series. They let you use another Navi, basically. But listen, you're not really, like, changing Navis or anything, but you're basically, like, summoning roll to help you. It's nice. It's convenient. Anyway, uh, looks like we can jack in, so let's do that. Let's do that. Jack in. MegaMan.exe. Transmit. I'm still thrown off by that. Because it's a uh, Jackie and Mega Man uh, Jackie and Mega Man exe uh, execute or something, something like that. But whatever. Uh, the net looks so different. The World Three must have done this. We'll have to fix the net later. Mega Man. First, let's find the program locking the doors. Roger. All right. Going down from here, you'll see the door lock. Normally, you can get there very easily, but currently there are breaks in the network. All right. I guess I'll show some of the random encounters in this area for now, since it's a new dungeon, and, uh, yeah, you might as well. Same old, same old viruses, though. New dungeon? Who gives a fuck? <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna try to get them all in a line, so that way we can get a... this going. There we go. Right, that's right, and Shockwave C. C's not even that good of a code in this game. If I recall correctly, but whatever. Uh, do you want to go to the lock? Uh, n no. <laughs> what? Wait a minute. Oh. <laughs> Just O? Just O? Excuse me. Just O. Okay. Whatever. Uh, let's do this. So this, the... I forgot the name of this virus on the bottom. Well, no, top. You're not going to get a chance to see them, but they're, they're a virus that jumps around a bit, and then 
after a certain amount of time, they'll turn into, like, they'll, they'll basically try to squash you on your side of the arena. So, they're, they, they can be dangerous, but they're usually not too big of a threat, all things considered. Uh, okay, for some reason I thought I had a second B code, but I didn't. Here we go. Cool. I didn't think they would do that, but they did. Love that. Cool. So now let's see the brute mystery data before we move on. Shockwave L. Cool. Um. Yeah, let's move on. Hey, it's a, it's the virus that gives little bombs, and it's a chance to use roll. Uh, yeah, let's use roll. I'll use roll in a moment. First, let's charge up our Buster. So there's two stages of charge, which I probably should have mentioned. Uh, so when it's green, you do 16 damage as is. Uh, when it's purple, you do... Wait, no, 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 no. It's green does 8, and then purple magenta does 16. Uh, hey, cool, we got a little bomb. Little bombs are pretty decent chips, so I might start slotting those in soon. Uh, but yeah. Once you increase your power on the buster, the the amount of damage that your charge shot does will increase, as you would expect, so I'm looking forward to that. Let's go back here first. Alright, we, we that the door is passcode protected. The door will not open without proper authorization. Passcode hint. Number of chairs in 5A. We have to enter a passcode, huh? Land, how many chairs are in the classroom for 5A? Hang on, I'll go check. When you find out, hit the L button. Then I'll input the passcode. Alright. Well, let's go to 5A. Uh, what? You must... You, oh, the, we're in 5A. Okay. Okay, well, there's 9 then. I could have told you that immediately. For some reason, I thought it was telling me to go to a different classroom. 9. I don't think there's any punishment if you input the wrong number, so... Oh, I, I skipped dialogue by mistake. My bad. Thanks! I'll get everyone outside! Alright. So now, what is this gonna lead to? Uh, virus is the re-education program. I doubt most of the programs around here. That's sad. Uh, okay. I think they're- I think this virus is called, like, Flappy or something? I don't know. I like using Navi chips though because all you have to do is press A and they automatically do whatever they're supposed to do. Uh, so in the case of Roll, if there's any enemy, uh, the, cl the closest enemy to, to where you are, so the leftmost enemy, is the one that Roll will attack. Uh, so you just press A in a situation like that and she'll just take care of it immediately. I am unsure of what happens if there's two enemies in the same column, maybe we'll run into that. Uh, you know, that'll be a thing we experience, but, yeah. Um, let's do this. I want to get rid of this guy first, because this, that works out what better. Alright, here we go. We're going to see what the Flappy does. Eventually. Oh, maybe. Okay, we are. Uh, I need to get rid of the swords in my inventory. Or, uh, folder, rather. Yeah, it does that. At higher, like, versions of the virus, it'll do that attack faster, and then it'll also, uh, it will also, like, have a shockwave come out. Well, not, like, shockwave, more just, like, a little area of effect, like, thing around it, so you can't just avoid it super easily. Uh, let's get rid of steel, because I never use steel. Let's remove one of the swords. And then I had a third little bomb, didn't I? Yeah, little bomb here. Okay, there we go. Little bomb is nice to have, so I'll probably start. Like, well, I mean, obviously I did, but I mean, I'll, I'll want to start using it as a thing. So. Hey, look, another new virus, and this one will work perfectly with little bomb. I love that for us. Uh, yeah, I'll just I'll deal with the Metor later. We're not gonna even see what that virus does because I don't want to deal with it right now. I guess in the meantime, let's just do this. Uh, it doesn't matter. Now what happens? I'll never give up the fight. But yeah, I'll explain that virus maybe next time when I don't have an opportunity to kill it immediately. 
I don't know, can you blame me? Also, there was a blue mystery data back there that I missed, because I can see it right here. I want that blue mystery data. Uh, I might off-screen for it. In fact, I'm probably going to, but we'll see. We'll see if I can get to it right now, because if I can, then I'll just do that. Like, if it's if it's further down this path, I mean. Uh, all, both of these swords are useless to me right now, so... Mm, I don't have a great hand. Let's just do this, I don't fucking care. Actually, no, I do care. Fog do care. Go up. There we go. The fun thing about cannons is that they do next to nothing if they're not in, if they're not in your row. God damn it. Okay, uh doo -doo. let's kill you now. Killing you guy. Come on, I thought that would hit purple in time. Whatever. A bust rank of four, how embarrassing. Whatever. So, if we go up here, can I still get the blue mystery data over there? I might be able to, I might be able to. I, I'm gonna go back and talk to that program. Uh, can I kill the spooky? I think I can. I think I can if I play my cards right. Actually, yeah, I definitely can. So... Bye, Spooky. I guess I'll explain what the Spooky does now. Uh, the Spooky is the ghost. What happens is that anytime it's in the same, uh, the same row as you, it'll immediately teleport out. Uh, you can, obviously you can move into its row and attack it quickly, like I did earlier, but you generally are gonna have to think, like, use different ways of attacking it. Uh, and after a while, it teleports in front of you and attacks you with its tongue, so. Spooky, I know. Anyway. I control the library book loan data, but I've been damaged badly by the World 3. Please, repair the damage to the network. Alright. Library data locked for data preservation. Passcode required for entry. Hint, number of volumes of world history in the, of the world. I'm, I'm not even joking, I'm pretty sure I remember this. So I need to find out how many volumes of the history of the world there are, right? Be right back. Call me when you figure it out with the L button. I'm not even joking, I'm pretty sure it's 30. I'm pretty sure it's 30. No, not not 21. Yeah. I've played this game enough where I have that one memorized. <laughs> oh man. I'm I'm just saying, it's if you if you if I remember it, there's no reason to show it. Uh what's what, what is the story gonna be? The store is password protected. Going on over that proposition. Oh no, there's no passcode hint. What do we do? What? No hint. Well, let's just try anything. Input passcode. So there is an objectively correct way to do these types of ones. Uh, you want to go for 50 or 49, whichever. Uh, because that's going to be the midpoint of all the possible data values. So then you do this. Finalize passcode input. Passcode too high, access denied. So when you get that, what you do is this. You go half of 50. No, not 32 or 42. You do this. Now we go to 25. Passcode too low, second digit verification failure. So we know now with second digit verification failure that it's a, the passcode is somewhere in the 20s and it's above 25. So now we want to go to another number. Let's go to 28. 28, passcode too high, second digit verification failure. All right, access denied. So now we know it's either 27 or 26. I'm gonna say 27. Passcode accepted, lock release. Way to go. So yeah, that's what you do. And I did miss that blue mystery data. It's right down there. So I'm gonna off screen to that. I will be back in just a moment. All right, we're back. You missed pretty much nothing. It was just 800 zenny. Now we're 800 zenny more rich. Not richer, more rich. I mean, we're, not, we're, we're more than 800, really, because of all the random encounters so far, but whatever. You know what I mean. Man, man, got 400 zen. Look at that shit. We are filthy rich. I should have talked to that Navi. <laughs> I totally forgot to talk to him. I was too busy being Scrooge McDuck over here. Um, what do I want to do? I think if I time this right, I can get, I can get the cannon and the little tank at the same time, but it's going to be annoying. Quick! There we go. Wasn't that bad, actually. I can't wait till I get more power-ups, and I can either charge faster, or, conversely, I can just do more damage. 
Probably charge faster, though, because charging faster is more important to me. We got another little bomb. Let us lot out something for a little bomb. The swords are have got to go, in my opinion. Swords are not very useful in this game. In later game, swords are very useful. In fact, you could say mandatory, but we'll, we'll get there, maybe. Normally, you can just get to the teacher's lounge server by going up and to the right, but now there are several breaks in the network. Well, ain't that a shame. Let's move on. Another door. What's over here? Another door. All right. This door is passcode protected. The door will not open. Uh, blah, 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 whatever. So let's just do what we do, like always. Passcode too high, so let's go back to 25 now. 25, what are we looking at? 25 still alive. Access denied. Passcode too high. Okay. Uh, so unfortunately, sometimes you just get ones where it's too high and or it's too low and you're just, you're, you're fucked. Passcode too low, second digit verification failure. All right. Uh, second digit verification failure, so then let's do... Midpoint between 12 and 20 is uh, 16. Passcode too low, second digit verification failure. Uh, so now we have to guess. It's either 17, 18, or 19. Because I think after this attempt, it'll lock us out. So let's do 18. Passcode too low. Uh, I think it's a too low, right? Passcode too high. Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> uh, th that's what happens when you don't read, kids. Uh, let me let me just start over. Well, I mean, it, I was already starting over at that point. I just meant like reset the counter. Passcode too high. Reinput. 25. Uh, Pasco too low. Let's, 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 let's. So, in between 25 and, uh, 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 um, uh, uh, 50 is about 37. Pasco too high, second digit verification failure. Okay. So now, uh, midpoint between this and 30 is about 33, 34. Pasco too low. So now, uh, it could be any of these. 35. Passcode too low, so now we know it's 36. Okay. There we go. Lock release. Okay. I, I could have sworn this game doesn't give you enough to accurately pinpoint exactly which one it is. But I was wrong. No, it always gives you enough uh, to do that. That's nice of them. What about the other lock? Passcode protected. Don't want to lock. Uh, number of doors in the school. Uh, I'm just going to guess. Okay, teach me... Let's go with 12. 12 feels right. Uh, try again. I'm just gonna- I'm, I'm gonna be honest, it saves time. Okay, let's go above 12. Let's go with 13. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I just... 15? There we go! It saved time! It did, it saved time, so... Uh, let's check this area first, then, because that feels like that's the correct way to go. Um, yeah, little bombs. Let's just get rid of this tank in general, because it, it's scarier to me than the Metor, and neither are actually scary to me, so... Uh, cannon, and we're good. Bye forever. And more little bomb chips. Don't mind if I do. Where? There you are. Sword. Bam. Um, we're probably good. Boot. <laughs> Boot. <laughs> I didn't plan that. But yeah, we're probably good on little bomb chips now. I'll probably want to replace the B and T with O's if I ever get the chance. But whatever. Did you get Jack into any blackboard? Yes, I did. I always knew that. Lumistry data. Hey, HP memory. Now we have 220. I like that for us. I gotta stop saying that. <laughs> uh, okay, here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Watch what I do. Fucker. Okay. My plan with Shockwave is to do th that. So I try to trick it into going into the Shockwave row as I use Shockwave and then I run up to its row. It works most of the time because it, it, you can like manipulate it. It's fun. I don't know. Okay, uh, 
Excuse me. I'm trying to make progress here. Um, I actually want to get rid of the spooky so bad I'm willing to just do this. The last time I would probably use a sword in this entire Let's Play. Actually, no, 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 no. That's, that's wrong. I will probably use another sword in this Let's Play. It's just not going to be for a while. So, yeah. Hey, we got Invis! Nice. I want that. Invis is a very nice ship because, as you can imagine, it gives you temporary in invisibility. And that's just incredibly useful. I end up using Invis ships in basically every game that are available in this series because they're just... How, how could you not? <laughs> uh, Spreader H. Sure. Let's replace one of the shotguns because why not? Uh, shotgun K. Sure. Shotguns are next on my list of chips that I'm going to replace, so might as well start now. I should save. It's just occurred to me I haven't saved in a bit. That's the problem with this Let's Play is I'm going to keep forgetting I can save anywhere. Uh, if you're going to a save, you room, be very careful. The network is very unstable. Well, let's go over here, then. Uh, do, do, do. Yeah, let's do this. Okay, I want to line this up perfectly. There we go. Come back here. So now... This is a dead end. That's lovely. I'm glad we went all this way for that. That's very helpful. Thanks for telling me about the dead end, by the way. Um, yeah, sure. Same, same thing as the, as the other time. One, two, three. There we go. See, that's the fun of having a buster is that you're not always reliant on, uh, on the chips that you have. So, if you have a good buster, you can really make a lot of situations work for you, even in spite of that. Anyway, here's a new enemy type. So that's a hand. What is it gonna do? Well, it's gonna grab something. What's it gonna grab? I'm not gonna let you see. Uh, it grabs a bomb and it puts it in your square, and the bomb goes off after three seconds. It's annoying when you don't have a lot of chips to work with. Also, that sucked. Uh, yeah, that's fine, actually. That's the only combination that works. There. And now... What do you have to say? Nothing. Okay. Oh. Okay. I didn't realize that would happen. I, I forgot about that. Whatever. Whoa! Lan! What's wrong? S -s Sorry, I I'm stuck in a trap. I, I can't move! Why is this shock? Like, sometimes it's... Yeah, like, like, right now, it's full. Like, it's not blinking. And now it's blinking. It's weird. Maybe it's something to do with the GBA emulation on the GameCube? Whatever. Where are you? Near the AV room. S sorry Don't worry, I'll check it out. Well, off to the AV room we go. What happens if we press L here? Look, lay on the AV- Okay, that's all. Finally got out of the classroom, isn't that nice? Uh, is there anything here I want? What's up, Land? They announced playing in your class too? Uh, I don't feel like reading all this right now. I'm just trying to see if there's anything worth getting. Like, anything that'll... I'll grab, but nah. Um, which room are the stairs? Wow, you're, you're hopeless. Whatever. And dead end, I should have remembered that. I'm hopeless. Now, what, what, what decks? If we don't do something... Excuse me, I forgot the decks voice. Forgive me. If we don't do something, the World 3s will take us over! Alright. What is this horrible, like, like, fucking southern accent that I've just developed an affinity for? Me, I'm a first grader with a the, with the head the size of a fucking planet. Hope everyone's okay! Yeah, 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 yeah. What do you want? Now this one is locked. Okay, uh... Let's destroy the lock program, that's nice. There's the AV. Oh, okay. Sorry, Snort. 
Wait, 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 what's going on? Okay, we'll never know. So this is, uh... This is the AV room, I take it? Wait, no, it's not. Okay, I guess Higsby just moves out of the way and unlocks the door for you, right? Because he's going through here. Now this one is locked. Oh, he didn't... Okay. Alright. What am I... What am I missing? What, what, what did you want me to do here? Looks like you can jack in here. Okay, cool. Oh, repair A. Cool. That's one less ship to worry about, but... What? What was Higsby doing in here? What do I need to do? Ah, whatever. I'm feeling kind of... Kind of, uh... Fresh and yummy. I, I don't know. World 3 programs are in to work. Please hurry. Where is the fucking AV room? I don't remember. Always nice to be greeted warmly. Yeah, it is. Statue created by the... We'll, we'll read all this shit later. Now is not the time. Oh, children scared, blah, 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 whatever. What I want to know is, uh, if the world... Never mind, actually. Seriously, where is the AV room? I don't remember. Am I... Am I... In... Oh, it was... So this is the AV room. We were supposed to be here. Okay. Well, what the fuck? I interacted with stuff in here and there was nothing I could do, right? Oh, okay. Your computer is fixed. Okay. Well, that's on me, I guess. W whatever. Told you I'd get you out. Should have read the first line, but whatever. Anyway, we now know that this is the wrong path to go on. Okay, there was nothing. I'm glad we explored that path to its fullest. Ah, well. I'm so used to Invis being an asterisk code, but asterisk isn't in this game, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna unfortunately be left wanting to use it more than I can, actually. Whatever. Fuck, that was mistimed. Ah, uh, whatever, that's on me. I was trying to get them in a, in a row, but I, like, couldn't do it correctly, so I fucked up. Ah, well. Um... Let's do this. I can kill this one with my buster. Asshole! Maybe I can't. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool. I'll go fuck myself then. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> Why am I getting destroyed here? Like, I'm not gonna die. I'm just, like, getting my ass whipped up and down the b-ball board. Whatever. Three! Love, love to get a three. At least we got money. At least, at least. So now, another door. What's over here? Uh, blue mystery data. Let's grab it. Jesus. Think we get enough shockwaves? Okay, I want to get this hand in the correct position. Fuck. What? Oh, okay. Okay, can I do this? There we go. See what I mean about manipulating spookies into the right path? It's easy. Also, Time Bomb 1. Time Bomb isn't the worst ship ever, so I might consider using it. I don't know. It really... I, if I had more Time Bomb ships, I'd consider putting them in there, but... If it's just the one, I don't know. Doors password protected, none, blah, 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 blah. I don't know why they make you do this puzzle so many times. Because if you can do it once, you can do it any amount of times, really. So, passcode too low, access denied. I mean, I guess in theory you could do the passcode by random the first time or so, but like, doing it more than twice feels a little excessive, but whatever. Passcode too low, again. Uh, in midpoint of 75 and 90 is 80, uh, 87. Passcode too high, second digit verification failure. Okay, so it's between 87 and 75. Let's go... Or, 80 and 87, rather. Let's go with... 84. Passcode too high, second digit verification failure. Okay. Let's do 82. Passcode too high, second digit verification failure. Okay, 81. Passcode accepted. Hooray. Well, that was productive. I, I don't know. This dungeon's a lot longer than I remember, I'll put it that way. Uh, it's probably, it's probably not helped that I'm keeping in all the random encounters. It would still be the same length for me, but for you guys, it would be much shorter. 
But where's the fun in that? Okay, I got that one at least, so... But I, I couldn't have gotten both, I know that. Time to give you the boo! There's a joke in there and I didn't tell it. Invis, nice. Invis is just gonna be nice to have in case I need it, I don't know. Once I get my, uh, once I get my buster up to capacity, then it'll be very nice. Uh, there's, there's the Navi over there, by the way. Hi, I see you. Mystery data is Cannon C. Honestly, I'll, I'll do it. Let's let's put in Cannon C. So that way I get a chance to show off what the ABC cannon input looks like. It's not super duper useful, but if I'm gonna have the cannons, I might as well, you know? One of those things where it's like, I can't justify not doing it. There we go, just before it hit us. And then little Bomb to get rid of you, because I'm just... The best at spatial awareness. Bye bye. So now, okay, we're right there. Uh, I'm gonna save here just in case. The next boss isn't terribly difficult, nor is this puzzle, but uh, uh, you'll need to find an ID verification. I'll bet you, blah 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 blah, whatever. So now let's go. And where are we going? Why none other than the teacher's lounge? I know where Miss Mary is, but do you? Oh, okay. I can't do it. Uh, time recorder, you need an ID card. That's nice. Well, I've, you know, there's only so many options. Uh, yeah, wait a second. She's pretty old. Smells pretty bad. Box of floor wax. Good to know. Lo there is a lot of equipment used for gym classes here. Cool. Uh, what else, what else? Filled to the point of blah, 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 blah. Nothing I can get. Yeah, hold your fucking horses, Miss Mary. Uh, huge ball that's used on field day. It looks lonely here. Uh, use a lot of equipment. Okay. Oh, I knew there was something in here. I fucking knew there was something in here. That's why I was checking everything, because I remembered. I'm glad I got it now. Otherwise, it would have driven me insane, because I do plan on getting all the upgrades. Anyway, mm, mm, help me! Help her? Nah. Uh, uh, Lan, help me! I just had to. Help her. Lan helps us marry. Thank you! I can't believe that guy higs me! My ID card sure is thanks for saving me! Lan got school ID. Please try to help everyone. Can I... Can I just go back to you now? How do I... Oh, I have to do this. Never mind. I have to do it in the real world. Land, use the ID card to work. Mega Man, the server is just beyond the lock. But be careful. Okay. Alright. Uh. Yeah, okay. Uh, no, 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 no. Why even make us do this one again? This is the fourth time. Access to. or, uh, passcode too high. Got it. 25, maybe? Passcode too high. Second digit verification failure. So. 23? Let's go too high. Okay. 21. Let's go accepted. Hooray. Alright, it's boss time, baby. I might end the segment early because this is kind of a good stopping point once we get past uh, this guy. I didn't think you'd make it this far. We've got to stop the announcement program. Quick! Hmm? But being a World 3 slave is fun, isn't it, Mr. Higsby? Yes. With my new World 3 salary, I can buy lots of rare chips. <laughs> I knew it. And you call yourself a teacher. Yeah. <laughs> I did feel a little bad at first. <laughs> Mr. Higsby. Yes, but then I knew I'd do anything for rare chips, huh? Who needs rare chips bought with the World 3's dirty money? Ugh. Silence! Now you face me and Number Man! Gotta say, that's probably the lamest possible, like, idea for an Avi, but I love Number Man's design. I think he's really cool and interesting. 
No problem. Let's go, Mega Man. Battle routine set. Execute. So this is Number Man. Uh, Number Man's honestly very easy. Uh, he has one real gimmick that you need to watch out for. Uh, and it's coming up. That. He'll summon number balls with numbers on them. And uh, you have to do the amount of damage listed on them to destroy them. And if you don't, they'll damage you. And it'll be very sad and, and everyone will cry. I, I don't know. The biggest problem is that Number Man has a decent amount of HP for this point in the game. So it's just going to be kind of a slog trying to actually kill him. Because I don't have much I can do. Uh, as far as the number balls go, I'm not terribly worried. Uh, APC, sweet, sweet. Wow, that that's incredibly cool. Uh, yeah, let's just let's just show it off. Advance ABC, Zeta Cannon one. So now we can do this Zeta Cannon. So we mash A, and unfortunately, he doesn't do too much against Number Man because he has invincibility frames. But I thought it would be neat to show off. So, uh, da, 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 da. I would rather have the little bombs right now. I don't give a shit about Number Man damaging me, to be honest, so. Because it, it just doesn't matter. Da, da, da. He doesn't have much HP left, but. Yeah, I guess little bomb it is. Come on. Okay. This is what Time Bomb is, by the way. Fuck. I didn't get it in time. I didn't get it in Time Bomb! Yeah, this is why Number Man is kind of annoying, because it's like, he's not hard. It's just, I don't have a lot of damage to deal. So, it's just like, I'm kind of here. Just, just waiting to do damage. He's actually getting... Yeah, that was actually a little scary. Well, not scary. Because I wasn't scared, but more just like that was actually getting kind of close for comfort. Whatever. 1500 Zenny is pretty nice, though. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, you've been wrong all along. What are these sounds? Let's see you and your rare chips now. <laughs> Lan, I think he gets it now. I'm right, aren't I? It's true, Lan is right. I should collect chips by busting viruses. <laughs> I'll be good now, I promise. Trade chips sometime? Sure, what, what, what? Sure. Bitch, he just tried to fucking enslave you. Whatever. Uh, but... You do have to pay for your crimes, so... You better do something to help everyone out, okay? Land, restart the server and put the net back to normal. Okay. Bleep. Bleep. Okay, cool. Mail, how's it look? Land, the announcement program stopped. You did it! Hey, not bad, Lan. Not bad at all. Not bad? You mean great? Yeah, well... You ain't seen nothing yet, Mega Man? That's Lan doing an impersonation of Dex. That's my... That's how I'm reading that. <laughs> what? Good job! Don't relax just yet, Lan. You got English class coming up. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I fixed the server too soon. After class. Ugh. Rough day today, huh? Uh, what? Today wasn't... Ah, uh, the Metro Line's opening today. Hey, let's surprise your dad down at Scilab. And then we can pick up that power-up program for me. Good idea. I thought the day would end by now, but alright. Lan, you have to do your homework. You have to go home and do your homework, even. What? You're gonna play? Jeez. Phew. Good thing we avoided blah 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 blah. Quite the day today, huh? Uh, better wait till my testicles drop. See ya. For your net navvy, the net is kind of like a dungeon. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, okay. I guess we'll get the power program from uh, Dr. Hikari. 
I don't feel like talking to anyone in school because, frankly, I'm just I'm tired of like reading out dialogue. I'm sorry. That's the problem with this game as a let's play is that I'm gonna be doing a lot of dialogue reading. Teaches cars. Seems to be a jacket in port for maintenance. Yeah, fuck it, sure. I guess once I grab the power up, then I'll end the segment. Cause fuck it. That's just the the, the motto right now. Fuck it. Like, well, why not? You just do everything. I'm the accelerator program. I make the car go faster. Over there is the brake program. Without him, this car wouldn't stop. That's concerning, but alright. I'm the brake program. I make the car stop. Over there is the accelerator program. Without him, I wouldn't be able to suck your cock. Whatever. Wow, that's actually... These are some actually challenging viruses for this point of the game. Uh, wow. I don't know what I want to do here. I can't escape. I'm actually concerned that they could be an issue. Whatever. Um, I, I guess let's do cross gun. See, the thing about the satellite guy is that you can't really tell who I'm talking about when I say satellite guy, I'm sure. But yeah, he's doing this. He's destroying all my panels. And I can't really do shit about it. Uh, yeah, this sucks. Yeah. Since now I'm. Tr oh, okay. He's not gonna. He's not gonna go for me right now. But that's. That's still a pain in the ass. But whatever. At least we have roll, so we can do this. I was expecting him to go for me directly. But, uh, I guess not. That's fine. Who knows? Maybe we'll get a good chip from this then. Six. Oh, sweet! We got Sonic Wave. Sonic Wave is a very good chip. I want it. I want it now. I don't care if I'm not gonna get a lot of it. I'm actually very tempted to grind here off screen, and I might. Uh. Yeah, I'm really tempted to. I'm gonna be honest with you. Because I want to get Sonic Wave. Sonic Wave is just a very good ship for this point in the game. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Uh, I'm probably grinding off screen again. That's... I hate that, but at the same time, it's like I can't talk myself out of it. Yeah, another Sonic Wave. And Sonic Wave, it's Shockwave, but better. And I can already use Shockwave, and it's like, why not? Why not? Uh, whatever. I'll... <sighs> yeah, I'll come back here off-screen. Where's the blue mist? There it is. Jesus. Power up, HP memory. Cool. Anyways, uh... Do, 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 do. Anything else in here? I don't think so. I'm on feed duty. Cool. You drop it. Whatever. Well, anyway, uh... Let's go get the power up and then call it. And where is the metro line? None other but... None other but. None other than down here is what I meant to say. I don't know where I got butt from. Uh, oh, I just remembered. I can't get the power up. Metro line's not running. Yeah, I just remembered that there's another thing I have to do. Did you hear about the landslide? No. A landslide? Not an opening day. Because of that, you can't buy tickets yet. Or did you want something else? What call? I don't care enough. So, let's see what you have to say. This is the ACDC Metro Line Station. Why do I look so glum on opening day, ass? Looks like there's a landslide and we can't run. Alright. Alright. Well, let's talk to you. What caused it? Whatever. I'm not reading all this dialogue. It's, it's Mega Man Battle Network. All you need to know is something on the internet is causing something in real life to not work. Yeah, I'm not reading that again. Uh, so yeah. Let's look for Let's check the net for info on the accident. Well, that is going to be some next segment shit, if you ask me. Because I don't feel like doing that right now. So, I'm going to end the segment in front of the car where it's strongly implied I grind for some sonic waves off screen. And uh, next time we will go a hunting on the net for a landslide. I don't know. I'll see you then.